In this presentation, we're going to focus on the radiographic positioning of the zygomatic arches of the facial bones. Essential projections include the submento vertical, or SMV, the tangential, the anterior posterior, AP axial modified town. For the SMV projection of the zygomatic arches, position the patient seated upright or supine. If supine, Elevate the thorax with a sponge or pillows to allow for easier extension of the neck. Hyperextend the patient's neck to place the IOML parallel with the IR plane. You may rest the vertex of the head on the IR. The MSP should also be perpendicular to the IR plane. Place the CR perpendicular to the IOML and ensure that it enters the MSP of the throat at a level 1 inch posterior to the outer canthi. The collimated field should be set to a size 8 by 10 inches. It should be noted that the technical factors for this view merely need to penetrate the arches, which are slightly thicker than the bones of the finger, and it is not necessary to use a higher technical factor as you would performing the SMV view of the skull. For the tangential zygomatic arches, the patient can be seated upright with their back against the vertical bucky or supine with their trunk elevated. Hyperextend the neck and rest the patient's head on the IR. Keep the IOML as parallel with the IR plane as possible. Starting with the initial positioning of the SMV view, rotate the MSP of the head 15 degrees towards the side being examined. This places the zygomatic arch parallel with the lateral border of the IR. Next, tilt the top of the head 15 degrees away from the side being examined. This motion frees the bases of the arch from superimposition of other cranial bones. Center the zygomatic arch to the IR. Place the CR perpendicular to the IOML and center to the zygomatic arch at a point one inch posterior to the outer canthus of the affected side. Center to the IR with a collimated field of 8 by 10 inches. This view should be performed bilaterally with opposing rotation and tilt for each perspective side. For the AP axial modified town view of the zygomatic arches, place the patient in a seated upright or supine position. The MSP should be placed perpendicular to the midline of the grid and the OML should be perpendicular to the IR plane. You may also use the IOML and increase the CR angle by 7 degrees if the patient is unable to flex sufficiently to place the OML perpendicular to the IR. The CR should be angled 30 degrees caudad to enter at the glabella, approximately 1 inch above the nasion. If the IOML is used, angle 37 degrees caudad. Center the IR and the CR with a collimated field of 8 by 10 inches.